Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Ness. If you are new to the channel, this channel provides a lot of product review, specifically footwear design. And sometime here and there, I will sneak in a couple of clothing pieces that I think that are interesting to share with you guys. And I always, always create a few different looks to give you guys ideas how to style them. Let's go straight into the first look on this video is the one that styling with the Converse TLC boot. Why I picked this look for my first look, it seems very basic, right? A white tee with the black denim jeans. Everybody can wear them, right? However, not a lot of people are able to pull them up because in order to wear a white tee and black denim jeans look good, you gotta be in shape. I don't care whatever people say or the style YouTube video or the channel say, style 101, you need to be in shape. That is the most basic fundamental of style. This second look also come from my Converse Chelsea boot review video. Um, this look make me feel like gangster with a bucket hat and also distressed denim jeans in the bottom and some tattoo showing. I mean, it look cool, but it's kind of dirty because I'm kind of growing my mustache during that time. So that's why I call this look, it's the dirty look. Let's go to the third look in this video is uh, the look that I create with the Nike ACG Modern Flight 2. At first, I'm kind of concerned when I bought these shoes in these colorways because the yellow colorway is not really something that easy to style. However, I've done a great job in the color blocking wise. You know, it's very balanced from the top to the bottoms, as well as the accessory that I wear with this outfit is really complement the sneaker very well. And go to the fourth look in this pick. I love this look because I truly believe that you don't have to follow the color blocking on your sneaker into your clothes. Um, I think that is a little bit basic. Um, in this outfit, you can see I didn't really follow the color blocking. Some of it, but not all, right? Um, that is how the outfit a little bit special because of the green color pop just kind of make people to focus on your shoes more than the outfit. And let's go to the fifth look in this video. It's the look that I picked from the Adidas collaboration with Valley. This is kind of like an anime cosplay custom outfit. The most standout detail on this outfit is the crop blazer that I got from Zara in the woman department. Look mad good. You know, you wouldn't know if I don't mention this black blazer is from the woman department, right? And I am a master of styling black on black, so it would never go wrong when I styling black colored clothes. That's how I actually get into style first. You know, I would recommend people who are trying to find their own style, try to go with like a black color first. And also it's not that expensive as well. There's ton of brand creating black color clothes. And the sixth look in this video is also from the Adidas collaboration with Bally's. Um, I would never left out camouflage pants. This camouflage print would never go wrong with black shoes and black clothes. Please do not wear the Cheeto pink camouflage. Those are really useless and childish, you know, don't really look good. Camouflage is basically for what? It's camouflage, right? you can plan in with the environment. That is how you call the name of this print is camouflage. But those Cheeto pink camouflage, man, if you wear that print in the forest, you're gonna get caught, man, with the headshot. Next is the outfit that I create from my sneaker review, the Nike ISPA body and mind. I know hater gonna hate this shoes, right? But as a designer and creative person like me, I really like this shoe's constructions and the innovations from Nike ISPA team brings to this shoe. 
it's really up to you that how you actually style them. Even though the shoes, as some people say, it look like homeless, but look at this outfit that I create with this sneaker. It look mad good and clean. If you like my video so far, please give me thumb up. I would truly appreciate it. Next is the number eight look that I create in the Oakley Job Saw sneaker. Um, I think this look is a little bit trendy. Baggy sleepless sweater with the baggy jeans and also the junky shoe. That is typical for this 2022, 2023. A kind of outfit. Usually I'm not really into the trend, but I like this look. You know, it's made me a little bit different, like planning into the kit. However, though, my lips, man, is a little bit weird in this outfit because it's, I look like a goldfish mouth, you know, because of the mustache that I have. It's kind of curved down like this, you know, make my mouth is like this. You know how the goldfish mouth is open like that, you know? I didn't really open my mouth, but my mouth have the same shape naturally like that because of the mustache. But hey, that is not really <laughs> related to the outfit. Next is the, the night outfit. Um, this outfit also is a black on black outfit that I create in the Y3 Gazelle sneaker review video. This outfit is really kind of white three ish and you would never go wrong when you wear white three products in black too right this white three sneaker probably is the more expensive sneaker that i bought for this 2023 um i think it's cost three almost four hundred dollars next is the number 10 looks man when i look at this outfit man i hate both shoes i still hate both shoes i wish the white button up shirt underlay could tuck in to make the looks more complete than it just like leave it out like that. But overall, I think this look very nice. I like it. I look like a rich kid that go to private school and spending my parents money. Okay, the 11 looks in this video is the collaboration between Timberland and Leon. I love the looks that I create to go with the shoes. It pretty much bring out the value on these shoes. The bad boy look is absolutely my favorite. Look at this, man. I am a gangster. I am a cool boy in the roof. That is why I like this look. And the jacket though, my younger brother say it look like a used tower because of the texture that you borrow from the mechanics. Next is the 12 looks I create from the Onisuka Tiger Dentris Puff sneaker review video. Um, I think I done a great job styling on black again. Um, and also this is my type of style that I would go to. If you look in this outfit, right? It look very basic, it's just like black sweater, black caro pants and black sneaker. However, when you focus on the detail wise on the classes that I wear with the silver frame match with the sweater, a zipper tee around the shoulder. Silver is more like a pop color detail for your black clothes. That's why you see this entire outfit is really nice together. Love this outfit. Uh, if you see me in real life, this is the outfit that you will see me wear. The 13th outfit in this video is also come from the Onisuka Tyrese Puff Sneaker Review video. Um, I picked this look because they look very good with the Puff jacket and the Puff sneaker. And also my trapper hat from Snow Pick. And also another detail that I would like to point out is the leather gloves that I wear. This look is suit more for those who are performer on stage. And the last outfit that I picked in this video is the collaboration between the North Face and Undercover. The outfit I create to go with the shoes is really, it's give me the vibe of a, a good guy gone bad because of the big round glasses that I wear in this outfit. So there you have it. This is my 14 favorite outfit that I personal pick. Um, if you really pay attention to all this outfit, 
in this video, right? They're not really expensive. You know, you don't have to spend so much money on this expensive clothes brands to have a good style. Some pieces, they are brand names, but it's not really majority on this 14 looks, right? It just depends how you actually have a good taste, good eye, and how you really experiment with the outfit, the clothes you have in your wardrobe. You know, less the less clothes that you have in your wardrobe, you will solve more problem and also it kind of force yourself to be more creative in your clothes. And most importantly, stay in shape. Not just buy some brand name, trendy clothes to put in your body, but you're not even in a good shape. And if you like one of the look in this video, please give me more thumb up because that is my only wish for Christmas. And subscribe to my channel for more video. I have a lot of video coming up every single week and I can't wait to share with you guys.